Hi everyone, can you hear me? If you can't hear me, put up your hand and I'll try to speak up. The US, uh, if the US wants to treat Julian fairly and well, they should drop this case. They should release Julian from prison because he is suffering right now. In court today, Mark Summers, QC, Julian's defense, said that there is nothing normal about this case. There is nothing normal about this case. And it's not just the defense that says that. The CPS told Sweden in 2010, please do not think that we are treating this as a normal extradition case. This is a political persecution that has used the law, extradition law, as a tool to further its political agenda. To take revenge on a journalist for what? For the publica publications that he is now indicted over. Publications that revealed war crimes, targeted assassinations, rendition, torture, but also the US subversion of the judiciary in Germany, in Spain, in Italy, when those judges, those investigators, had the gall to investigate those same crimes, to investigate CIA rendition and torture of their citizens. This US extradition case has been falling apart since the moment it started. Because it was born rotten, it was born at a time when the CIA was plotting to assassinate Julian. And it is also proving to be devastating for the US in the courts. Not only because the US prison system and its inhumane conditions is exposed before these courts in its full barbarity, but also because the crimes that have been undertaken by the US government against Julian are also exposed before these courts. Today, we were able to air in court Mike Pompeo's plans his sketches and options to assassinate Julian in London. To assassinate a journalist in this city for doing his job because he exposed their crimes. This country cannot tolerate, should not tolerate, the targeted assassination of journalists for doing their jobs. This should be obvious, we shouldn't be here. I hope the courts reach the right conclusion. But I also call on the US government to not just say they defend media freedom, to not just say journalists shouldn't be killed or imprisoned, but actually they should walk the walk, not just talk the talk, they should drop this case. They should free Julian. Thank you.